What's up guys? Welcome back to Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 2X. So today we're tackling the Pro Skater 1 career all in one video. I did not remember doing this, but it's all in one video. It's about 16 minutes long, I think. So we're going to have to really improvise on this commentary. I think we can do it though. I, I certainly hope we can. Uh, so we're going to start out with Warehouse, just like in Pro Skater 1, air over that fucking K. You know, that's what you have to do. That's the secret to getting the letters, is air right over them, don't collect them. That is how you do it. Um, I like this version of the Warehouse, it looks really clean compared to the kind of uh, weird look that the Underground 2 version, well it was called Training Them. I don't know, I didn't really like Training as much as I did normal Warehouse. Um, I kind of, the new area is just kind of boring, but no controversy here. If you like it, that's okay. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and move right along to the next level, which you already know is school one, not school two, the best level ever. It's school one, the okay level. I'm not a huge fan of this level either. There's not many levels in Pro Skater 1 that I really, really like. There's only... Well, actually, my favorite level of all time happens to be in Pro Skater 1, weirdly enough. But I don't like the majority of the levels in Pro Skater 1. That was very weird. I just literally wall rode that wall. I don't know how to word that, but I did a pretty good job messing it up. Uh, so here I go rolling back on that unintentionally. Well, nice. Nice. Trying to... Try to do some pizzazz right there and it ended up falling. That's alright. So got the secret tape. Big drop. Dead. Not sure. I, I, you know, I'm glad they kept the normal goals in this this section of the playthrough. Not section of the playthrough. Um, the section of the game. Because it, it seems more genuine, you know? It definitely seems like a a genuine homage to Pro Skater 1. Although it doesn't use the same engine as Pro Skater 1, which is totally okay. Um, it's like as near to the, as close as the game as it could probably get without overdoing it. Kind of like what Classic Mode did. Classic Mode really overdid it, but they kind of had to. Because you can't just have five goals in one level, you know. That'd, that'd be stupid. Um, or in this case, you have six. I think you have six. I'm pretty sure you have six. Not 100% sure though. No, you have five. You have, yeah, you have five. Okay. I can't count. So that's okay. Counting's not important. Don't believe me on that one. But, uh, Maul, I'm not a huge fan of Maul either. I'm going to keep telling you how many levels I hate in this playthrough. Maul is definitely one of those levels. It's just, it's too linear, you know? There's, the point of Tony Hawk is to have some variety in your skateboarding. The mall downhill jam, um, even downhill from Pro Skater 5, uh, mountain I guess it's called, whatever. It's just too linear. Maybe that's why I don't like uh, downhill jam too much, I like the game downhill jam. It's too linear. I gotta get back to that by the way. I do have to find out where um, I left off in that game. I want to finish it. It's gonna take me a while though. That game is long because it's so redundant, which is ridiculous, but it's okay. We'll finish it eventually, I have no doubt. I really want that skate deck. That that deck is so sick, dude. That that uh, yellow and red ketchup and mustard kind of birdhouse deck is so sick. I wish I had one. I really like the look of that board. I think I went over my favorite boards. I'm not sure. I get I get really confused with my commentary sometimes. But here's our first competition, Chicago. I kind of like this level. I'm not, I'm actually a pretty big fan of Chicago. It's not a bad level. It's kind of small, but I mean, it's good. It's a good level. It's got some cool lines to it, especially uh, if you played in Thug Pro. Get a lot of wall rides involved. Pretty sick level. Look at me fucking ending it right away. Like a speedrunner or some shit. I think they did a pretty pretty darn good job with this game. It's pretty good. I did find out that I did not record the uh, bonus levels that you get. Um, including Skate Heaven. I didn't, I didn't unlock Skate Heaven because 
well, I only completed the game with my character. Um, I didn't actually complete the game with all the characters. So, I'll probably have to do some super secret cheats to uh, unlock that and show that off. But don't expect that right away. Um, that would require me to get my Xbox hooked up again. That's gonna that, that's gonna take me a while to to want to do that. Uh, I'm probably gonna focus on downhill jam after this, so I can get that that squared away. I kind of don't want my Tony Hawk playthroughs to be incomplete, especially because those are what I focus on the most. But Minneapolis is okay too. It's not a bad level. It's it's pretty big for a Pro Skater One level. I'm pretty impressed that they they made a level this big. Or at least it seems big. Maybe, maybe it's the, the illusion. Not sure. Look at that. Secret tape. I got it the weird way. That's alright. Doing things the weird way. Look at that. That was that was garbage. I can't believe that happened. I I totally on my side here. With uh, The game did not want me to get up there with that wall ride. Ooh, how did I get that E? This game's like out to get me, it seems. Yeah, get that. Got the signs. I didn't do much editing in this episode. I actually did like very minimal editing. I, I sped up one part because I it was... Yeah, you already saw me do it. We'll get to that part. Don't worry. Don't worry. We'll, we will get to that part when we get there. I am going way too fast. So I gotta put the brakes on. Um, I don't know what I'm doing here. I hope I get the skate letters. Totally busted through that brick wall. I kind of like this little area here. It's kind of neat. It's kind of weird, but pretty good. Here we go. Burnside. Yay, the best level in the entire game. Burnside. There's, there's a reason why people hate it. But first, let's go to an even worse level, I feel. Downhill Jam. Downhill Jam is an absolute god, stupid fucking level. I don't know why I said god there. I think I was going to say goddamn. Goddamn stupid level. Sounds as dumb as I thought it would. So I got to get skate, got to get the valves. I uh, got to get the high score. And secret tape. Secret tape I always have trouble with in this level. But the the thing with the Pro Skater 1 career in this game is that by the time you get to it, your stats are already fucking maxed out, you know? Oh man, I didn't even take the, the easy route here. I went the I went the whole way. Taco Bell. Look at that. I think I have enough speed here to get it. Nice. Nice. Maybe the first time in history I got that first try. Outside of Thug 2. Yeah, I don't know why they keep remaking this level. They, This level's in like fucking three, four games. It's unbelievable. They should stop. This level's not that great. I don't know who the hell keeps approving it. It's not that good. So you got it in Pro Skater 1. You got it in Pro Skater 2X. You got it in Underground 2. Uh, what else do you got in? Underground 2 Remix, if you want to argue that. I don't know if they had it in, um, something tells me they probably had it in Project 8 Classic Mode. I'll have to look back at that. I guess I can look it up now. I'm not going to miss much. I'm, I'm doing Burnside now. So let's go uh, pro Project 8. Actually, why don't we just go to my playthrough? That's probably a better idea. Look at that. Since I named them after the levels, it makes sense, right? Did I even make a... I did. Um, Alcatraz, Phoenix. Isn't that... They did. They absolutely did. They did do it in Project 8. That's unbelievable. I can't believe they keep doing this. Fucking, this level, that level's not even that good. I act as though we're still on it, but we're not. We're on Burnside. Burnside has not been remade. I think they know that level sucks, but I think someone should let them know that Downhill Jam is not that great of a level either. But 
Pro Skater HD too. The fuck? Then they made their own like variation of it in Pro Skater 5. Like, come on. Here is my favorite level of all freaking time. I absolutely love this level. I don't know why they didn't remake this one. This one's great. Streets of San Francisco. I absolutely love this fucking level. And I was very lucky enough to receive a, uh, a port of this level from Team Goat for uh, Thug Pro, which is now public. But, man, is this level sick. It's so cool. It, it's, just, I don't know, it's just so great. I have a lot of great memories playing this level when I was younger. I absolutely love this level. A lot better than Downhill Jam, I'll tell you that. No one likes Downhill Jam. Unless you're fucking insane or some shit. I don't know. I'll judge you on that one. I'm going to be judging if you like Downhill Jam. There's nothing fun about it. It's all downhill. But, uh... Yeah, I mean, you could argue this level doesn't have much to skate off of, but... I don't know, man. It's just... It's still good. It still has plenty of stuff. I think. I think it's a good scenic level, too. But... This is actually a two-run... Uh... Run. Two-run run. I, I messed up on the, the police cars, so... That's that's the part I sped up. Spoiler alert. That's when I, that's when I sped that up. But you'll see that. And right now I'm just collecting skate. See I'm running low on time. I really like the look of this level. It's just so cool. I don't know what I'm doing here. I think I was going to go get the secret tape, but I was like, well, I really don't have much time, so. But that's okay. Secret tape in this level is kind of crappy in uh, Pro Skater 1, because you never know how much air you need. It's like you need to select the decks with um, more air. Yeah, I even got the pro score. I think I tried the manual here too. No, I didn't. Wow, I didn't even try. I'm a loser. Alright, so this part I sped up, so you won't have to... I only sped up by a little bit though. It looks kind of cool though. Look at that. Whee! If only the game was really this quick. Speaking of quick, uh, Pro Skater 4. If you've never seen the, the speedrun for Pro Skater 4 by Crad, I think I think it's time for you to see that because it's pretty damn good. It's pretty sweet. Um, I've been trying to speedrun Pro Skater 4. I, I mainly do the ILs, the individual stuff for the goals, which you've seen uploaded on my channel. But that dude is just absolutely crazy with Pro Skater 4, and he's still tackling some ILs. I told him to take every single one, but he said he doesn't want to, which I I doubt because I know he wants to own Pro Skater 4 in all its glory. Uh, so now I'm going for the secret tape. Pro Skater 4 is one of the coolest games ever. It's got it's way too cool. Um, it's definitely one of the more interesting speedruns because it's you can't get off your board one, obviously, and it's just it's so fast, you know. And the way that that a uh, crad controls a skater in Pro Skater 4, it's it's unbelievable. It's absolutely unbelievable. It's not something you you think. I don't even know how to explain it. He plays in such a unique manner. I guess it's because of all the King of the Hill he did back in the day. I didn't think I was gonna get this, but I got it. I was very impressed. So here we go. I'm gonna go to the last level here. Um, so I'll probably make a bonus video later on for the unlockable levels you can get, which is uh, Skylines and Skate Heaven. I think there's one more, but I'll get to that. I'll give my impressions on them. Probably won't dwell on them too much. Probably be like a quick 10 minute video or something. Hopefully with live commentary. Try to make it more interesting. But with the, the post commentary, it's a lot easier to kind of set a day to record and then set a day to comment. But it also doesn't help when I forget to commentate and then I go back and watch my old stuff. Kind of like what I'm doing here. Look at that 540. That was sick. I don't know why I'm still going. Yeah, like I fucking destroyed. 
Roswell's okay. It's not the best level, but I do kind of respect it. It's a really unique level. Could be worse. Could be worse. There is worse. There's the alien. I know you guys want to see that. Yeah, it's got some cool, cool looks to it. Got those flashing lights on it. Again, I don't know where I'm going still. I, I've definitely reached the, the peak of uh, this level. But I hope you guys enjoyed this playthrough of Pro Skater 2X. Again, I, I hope it, re it makes it better than my last playthrough of it. But if you liked it, leave a thumbs up. I'll see you guys in the next playthrough. I'll probably get back to Downhill Jam. And I'll see you guys then. Have a super amazing day, everybody. Goodbye.